In the third installment of the 2013 Stars and Stripes campaign, Blair Underwood discusses the relationship with his father, lessons learned, and what he's passed on to his children. Yeah, my father is a very, I wouldn't say soft-spoken, but he's uh, reserved. He's cool. He's laid back. So his leadership style has always been to lead by example. And one thing he told me a long time ago was always let people save face. Don't ever disrespect people in front of other people. People want to save face. People want to be respected. And respect shows itself and manifests in many different ways. When my father hit the door, part of the respect my mother said from the beginning was, whatever you're doing, you get up and you, you welcome your father into this home because he's out there working hard every day so you can, and in many, and oftentimes, especially in this, this, this job description, risking his life. And you come show him respect. So of course, when I come home, you know, I, I'd say the same thing to my kids, you know, you, you, whatever you're doing, get up and say hello, it's not just me, but to your mother also. Um, that comes from that idea of respect. We were raised to just kind of understand that um, if, you, if, if you work hard enough, you can, you can accomplish certain things. And you don't have to be defined by your race. So we were, of course, of course raised to understand that there's a great strength in, in and be proud of your culture and be proud of your history. Um, but let it be an asset to you. Don't let it become an excuse to why you can't do something. And I think my livelihood and my lifestyle growing up in a military family really spoke to that um, and really solidified that, that sense that you can do and become anything. And that's because of that military framework. You learn and get such a sense of, of respect and duty and honor to something and someone bigger than yourself uh, and, and the ideals of, of freedom and fighting for freedom. Uh, is it a perfect country? By no means. Um, is it the best country in the world? I believe it is. For more on the Stars and Stripes campaign, be sure to log on to Vibe.com.